Now I will introduce to you how to use Shepard 220 fingerprint lock. First, let's take a look at the outer appearance of the lock. The outside unit includes the series of accessories such as protective cover, indicator, scanning window, LED display, functional keys, outer handle, override keys cover. Function keys include menu button, cycle button, delete button, store button, and power on button. The inside unit includes inside locking button, battery cover, M3 screw hole, inner handle, pinch screws, and RS-485 port. Before using the lock, we remind you to place finger on the process of the center of the scanning window, flat with slight pressure and motionless during the save and match process. Please note that 100 fingerprints can be stored in the lock and each finger will be scanned twice. The ID number from 1 to 5 is for administrator, from 6 to 50 is for the users. Only administrators have the right to add or delete user fingerprint and code. Next I will show you how to store an administrator fingerprint. Under locking mode, turn the protective cover to power on the system and then press and hold store button for 3 seconds. The number 01 is displayed along with the beep. Press store button again and put finger on the scanning window to store fingerprints. During the period of saving the fingerprint, you will see the scanning window blinking red twice number 02 is displayed, indicating a successful scan. When the second administrator's fingerprint is stored, the number 06 is displayed automatically. You need to press cycle button to select a desired ID number. If you want to save code, please shut the protective cover and press power on button. And then press and hold the store button for three seconds when you hear a beep. The number zero is displayed indicating begin to save code. You are required to input seven digital code. The LED display shows zero again after you input in full code. You need to input and confirm the code again. When hearing two prompt beeps, it is in a successful storage. Three prompt beeps indicate that it has failed to save code. We recommend you verify the two administrators' fingerprints first before storing other users. If you fail to verify fingerprint successfully, please delete it and store fingerprint again. We would suggest that every time a user save the administrator's fingerprint, he must record his different fingers, that is, thumb and forefinger, at the position of two administrators separately in order to keep administrator's fingerprint more functional. Now I would like to show you how to store more user fingerprints and codes. Turn protective cover to power on the system. Then press and hold store button after an administrator's fingerprint is matched successfully. The current ID number is displayed. Next, press cycle button to select desired ID for either administrator or user. After this, press store button and put finger on the scanning window when LED blinks. For storing code, please turn off protective cover, then press store button to input seven digit code. Please note the following steps. When storing fingerprint, three prompt beeps indicate that it has failed to store fingerprints. When storing the code, three prompt beeps indicate that it has failed to confirm the code. When 100 fingerprints are stored, the FU is displayed. Next, I will show you how to delete fingerprint and code. First, power on the system. Press and hold delete button after an administrator's fingerprint or code is matched successfully. The current user ID is displayed. Second, press cycle button to select a user ID which you want to delete, and then press and hold the delete button. You will hear two prompt beats indicating successful deletion. When all administrators are deleted, all users will be eliminated automatically. Now I will show you how to delete all fingerprint or codes once. First, power on the system, then press and hold store button and delete button simultaneously after administrator's fingerprint or code is matched successfully. The UU is displayed indicating all fingerprints or codes are deleted. When only two administrators are stored, you can delete their fingerprints freely. Press delete button first and then turn protective cover to power on the system. After this, press inside locking button before indicator light turns off. 
You will hear two prompt sounds indicating a successful deletion. The UU is displayed as well.